Hi guys, my name is Gina James Cole and welcome to day six of Clara's pregnancy. She has just woken up, it's the start of a new day. It is the final day of her second trimester. And let's go into the pregnancy tab and see the tasks that she needs to complete today. Oh, I was gonna say she hasn't got an appointment today. Oh my goodness, there's so many today. <laughs> That's a lot of tasks. Hopefully these are short tasks. The first thing is, to set up a nightlight in the nursery. Okay, so we haven't, in yesterday's episode, I was saying I wanted to start a nursery. And I think, or oh, put down some new flooring in a nursery. So I think today, yeah, we're going to move house. In fact, I have got, let's go over to where they are moving to. And we will start kind of preparing the nursery. Okay, here's the house. It was, I think it was an architect home that I'm just kind of re decorating and moving around slightly and this is going to be the nursery it's quite a large nursery so what was it that she needed to do she needed to set up a night light in the nursery so in fact yesterday we bought a few items from the maternity store we got some of the contemporary items hopefully and fingers crossed i'm hoping that we get 6,300 so we can get this mobile and then we've got all of them from all of the items from set one of the contemporary and then when we've got all of the items from set one we will get the prize of these items so hopefully we will get enough tokens today to finish that but for now let's go into the infant section oh in fact we'll see oh yeah look Contemporary brown and contemporary olive. These are items. We should place them down, right? Should we wait and see if it's a, a goal in... We'll, we'll wait and see if it's a goal from the tasks to place anything like that down. But she needs a nightlight. So, I mean, we don't know whether we're having boy or girl. So we're going to decorate this in neutral colours. And a nightlight. Let's place this nightlight down. I don't know whether it has to be this. Oh, can it not go on there? Okay, hang on. It'll just... We'll just put it on the floor for now then, that's fine. And that's task complete. So obviously, I'm not sure which, whether you have to use that specific um, baby infant night light. If anyone has any information to try any different lights, let us know that down below in the comments. Let's go and look at what else we need to do. We need to take a selfie from the bathroom in the sink. Also, it's got there, put down some new flooring in the nursery and put up some new wallpaper. So we did buy the wallpaper yesterday. So, not the sim tracker. We don't want the sim tracker. We want the floors and the wallpaper. So the floors, we've got contemporary navy. So let's go, I mean, hmm, I'm not sure how much of a fan I am of that flooring for a nursery, to be honest, but this is the one that we got with the contemporary theme. So we're going to decorate with those items. So let's place the flooring down, and that's task complete on that. And also... The walls, we've got this contemporary grey, so we'll place that down. And that's task complete on that one as well. That's why we've got so many tasks, because there's some little short ones today. It's fine. Let's just get rid of this chandelier, because I don't want that chandelier. I probably don't really want these plants either. We'll just get rid of them. We can always place them back down if we do want them. Okay, so let's go back over to Clara at the old house. And she needs to take a selfie in the bathroom from a sink. So our... Uh, our nursery's coming along, the new house is coming along. By tomorrow's episode, I'm thinking, oh, take selfie. It's three hours and 20 minutes, so let's start that. I'm thinking that, yeah, I may just, today I'll spend the time redoing the house so they are ready to move in in tomorrow's episode. Oh, look, there we go. <laughs> She's taking a selfie. A few of you actually have asked me about this fairy. Where does this fairy come from? They are pet fairies are a prize from the Royal Lineage uh, Discovery Quest that you get if you go over to Mysterious Island and complete the, or build the castle. The quest from there is the Royal Lineage and the prize for that is Pet Fairies and they are pretty amazing. I do love my Pet Fairies. <laughs> Let's go over. Our support sims have finished sewing clothes. That's task complete. And the next thing we need to get them to do is like Clara's Simtress sim post 10 times on a computer. So, oh, somebody's ready to age up. We'll just leave them. I've got a house with loads of computers set up somewhere. I've got like random things all over in different houses. I think it's this house that they needed to... Uh, yeah, look, I've got <laughs> computers all out here. Oh, he's ready to move on as well. 
we can go over some sims and we'll start we'll start this sim oh and she's ready to move on as well <laughs> everyone's dying uh let's see like simtrest post is two hours and 40 minutes clara's finished taking a selfie in the bathroom now the next thing she needs to do is oh, show off baby bump to another sim and also there's discuss colours for the baby. Discuss colours for the baby? <laughs> like what colour the baby's going to be? <laughs> discuss colours for the baby with a sim. So <laughs> with, hang on, we haven't got Clara selected I don't think. Let's get Clara selected and we've got a sim over here. Yeah. Let's click on her and we can show off baby bump for 6 hours 15 and or discuss baby colours for 2 hours 15. We'll do the show off baby bump I think for 6 hours and 15 minutes. And also the sims that are doing the support task, the simtrest post, they are finished. So let's head over to them. There we go, task complete. Our goal today is to get, I don't think we're going to do it, but I would like to get enough uh, maternity tokens to be able to get where is it what are we getting contemporary yeah to get this olive mobile 6300 mm, I'm pretty sure we're not gonna get it <laughs> no we're not gonna get enough let's have a look unless we get over to uh, in the support tasks here where we get 5320 possibly we'll have to see but now we need to have 13 sims share parenting advice with another sim so Let's just have a sim selected. Click on another sim. Oh, this isn't working. And share parenting advice is 4 hours and 35 minutes. So we'll get 13, or we won't get 13 different sims. We'll get, we need an even number of sims doing that, don't we? But we'll get as many sims doing that as we can. You definitely need to have a full, well actually no, I was going to say you do need to have a full, uh, like lots and lots of sims in your town. But maybe you don't. Maybe if you are on a lower level, this is interesting actually, let me know down below in the comments because obviously like I'm on a level 55 game, I've got a very advanced game. If you have got a lesser advanced game, are you still having to get, like so in your support tasks, do you need as many sims to do, you know, to do the thing? So where I've got like have 13 sims share parenting advice with another sim. If you are of a lower level, like say you're on level 20 or something, do you only have to do like have six sim share parent advice with another sim? That'll be interesting to know. Clara has finished showing off her baby bump to another sim. And I think actually my other sims, yeah, they've finished their support task. So let's just go over to them and sort that out before we start Clara's new task. Hopefully I got enough sims taking part in this that this will complete. Oh no, don't tell me I didn't. No, I didn't. How many have I done? I've only done seven. Oh my goodness. So I thought that each sim that took part in it, so you do it once, and so that meant that two sims were taking part in it. But no, that it doesn't work like that, that you do it and only one sim takes part in that. Wow. That's a big ask. So I've got to do it all again. Oh my goodness, that's that's a lot to do. So like here, I thought that I would do one, share parent advice for 4 and 35, and I thought that I would get that that's two sims doing that. But no, I haven't. I've just got that one sim has done that. So I've got to do the whole lot again. That's difficult. Wow. And um, just on a kind of side note to that, I've just posted actually on my Facebook, Green Eye Gems Club, over on Facebook. You can, I mean, you can, by all means, you can leave these comments down below as well. But I've just posted on there about, I want to hear your, you guys' opinion on this whole pregnancy thing. It's difficult, right? There is a lot going on. Let's head back over to Clara to see what she needs to do next. There is so, so much going on with it. Let's just set her off. Discuss colours. Do you know what? Let's have um, an appointment. Let's do a yoga appointment. Because they are... Uh, hang on, call yoga instructor. These for me are six hours. Yeah, six hours, 15 minutes. Again, it's 206,280 for me. A lot of you have been commenting that that is different. Some of you have got it that it's one hour and 15 minutes. Like, oh my goodness, if it's different for you, please let me know down below in the comments. Like, what level are you on in the game? And like, because mine is, I'm on like level 55, which is the highest level. They're extremely expensive and take an extremely long time time but yeah going back to the whole kind of Facebook post that I've posted go over there and leave your comments if you would like to the Facebook my Facebook page is linked down below 
I'd just like to hear your opinions. Oh, they're not going to do yoga in the doorway, surely. Like, come out, come away from the door, Clara. You can't realistically do yoga there. And also, you've not probably got yoga shoes on. But, um, yeah, let me know your thoughts and opinions on this. I know that the daycare event was re-released today for players who haven't completed it before. And in my head, I think, like, I have completed the daycare event. But how on earth does anybody go through a pregnancy having, like, you've got to use, so... 34 sims, I'm allowed 34 sims in my game, only adults and teens, I'm not sure if seniors can take part of these things actually, because both of my seniors are ready for death, so <laughs> ready for moving on, so I can't use them, um, but how on earth can you do it, so if you still need to do the daycare event, how can you take part in the daycare event but still do this pregnancy? event if you've started it you just I don't see how you can well of course you can take part in it because realistically you only need your pregnant sim you, you don't have to do any of these tasks of course you don't have to do any of these daily goals and you don't have to do any of the support tasks of course just by doing them you are earning the maternity tokens that then mean you can buy maternity items from the store and apparently from my from what I've seen on social media, on Facebook and on Twitter, you have to complete a pregnancy and complete like everything, do all of the daily goals, all of the support tasks. You have to do that five, like five and a half times to get everything in the maternity store. So this is kind of, it's a long, long-term goal type of thing as opposed to something that we just complete very quickly. So, you know, it is something that's going to take us, if we're not using SP or LP or anything to speed anything up, or if we've, if we've not cheated our game, it's going to take a month or so, at least, to kind of get everything that we need from the maternity store. But yeah, just I'd just love to hear your, you know, honest opinions about the whole pregnancy event. I love it. I absolutely love it. I think there's a lot of wonderful elements to it. There's also things that I'm just like, oh my goodness, like this is this is so hard. This is really, really hard to complete. Just for the sim to complete all of their daily goals. Like it, it's a lot of time. It's literally like 24 hours a day. <laughs> You've got to be well, you don't have to be on the game 24 hours a day, of course. So like for right now, she's doing an event that takes six hours. I can leave the game for six hours. But I've got to remember to come back and make sure that she's then completing one of her other tasks, or the goals, I should say. There's a lot. There's a lot going on. Just let me know your opinions down below. Let's chat about it. Uh, have five sims get a snack for morning sickness from a fridge? Is this the house that I loaded up? Oh, no. I have a house that I put in loads of fridges. Let's go over to that house. Okay, I'm over at the house, and I have five fridges over here. So let's click on them and snack for morning sickness is 13 hours and 30 minutes. That's a long time. This is Yeah, these are three star fridges, so that's fine. That's the quickest we can do this in. Clara has finished discussing colours for the baby with a sim. And now she needs to, okay, she's got two more tasks. Call a nurse on the phone and eat some leftovers from the fridge. Surely eating leftovers from a fridge. Oh, hang on. I have not got Clara selected. Let's get Clara selected here. And then surely she just needs to... Whoa. Snack from what? Oh, no. Eat fries? Is that the leftovers thing? Hang on a second. Let me go back in. It says... Oh, eat some leftover fries. I thought it said just eat leftovers. You know, like the normal interaction with a fridge that is leftovers, there's 18 seconds. I thought that was it. I was like, yes, a nice short action. She has finished munching her way through those, like, leftover fries. I mean, that's gross, eating leftover fries. <laughs> Why didn't you eat them the first time? Let's go and have, take a look. Um, call a nurse on the phone for pregnancy advice. I hope this is a short task. I feel like... Oh, three hours and 20 minutes? Come on. I feel like I'm like a proper pregnant woman that is just, <laughs> you're getting further and further throughout pregnancy and there's more and more things that need to be done and you're just getting a little bit more irate and irritated by things. I feel like I'm getting that way, to be quite honest, <laughs> with Clara's pregnancy. Every task I have to do, I'm like, 
that like day one I was like oh yeah well, I'll go and speak to the doctor for six hours on day six I'm like I've got to speak to a doctor for six hours <laughs> Clara has finished asking for advice and that is goal set complete all the day's goals are complete and maternity tokens have been awarded. We have completed day six of Clarence's pregnancy. It's definitely been a difficult day. Definitely been a difficult day from my perspective in terms of just completing all the goals. I mean, we can't see them now, but just completing all the goals. It has been hard to get those done. We haven't got enough. I was hoping that by the end of today we would have enough to go into the maternity store and get the final, we're buying the contemporary theme. We wanted 6,300 to get this Olive Mobile which would then unlock the prize. We didn't get that, nowhere near got that. Tomorrow though we are all going to go into the third trimester so Clara's baby bump should get, well not should, will get bigger. I am looking forward to seeing move Clara. Yeah, I'm looking forward to seeing like the difference between like this baby bump. Oh she just rubbed it right on cue. I'm looking forward to seeing the difference between the baby bump that she's got now and seeing the baby bump that she has tomorrow morning when we open the game. But see the fairy running through there. <laughs> Love it. Thank you so much for watching this video. Give it a thumbs up if you are enjoying following along with Clara's pregnancy story. And I will see you tomorrow. Oh, she's tired. I feel you, Clara. I feel you. I will see you tomorrow for day... I don't even know. I feel like I'm delirious. What day are we going into tomorrow? We're going to day seven. I will see you tomorrow for day seven. Thank you so much for watching. See you tomorrow. Bye.